Yeah, Eamon, the FTC is suing Microsoft over its $69 billion proposed acquisition of Activision. Uh, this uh, lawsuit, based on this release we're just getting now, Eamon, it's saying uh, mostly focusing on competition and saying Microsoft has a pattern of acquiring game studios to snuff out competition in the console market. Uh, what They point to the acquisition of ZeniMax, which owns Bethesda software, which they're using to make exclusive titles on here. Now, no word on this lawsuit yet from Microsoft. But what they have said all along is, look, they are willing to, a lot of this hinges on the Call of Duty game, which is Activision's chief moneymaker. Sony and some other rivals have complained that allowing this to go through would give Microsoft an unfair advantage by making those titles exclusive to Microsoft platforms. But Microsoft is also offering that they would make Call of Duty available on other platforms for at least 10 years. They say they've offered Sony that 10-year deal. And just yesterday, they put out a joint announcement with Nintendo saying Nintendo agreed to that. So uh, nothing uh, from Microsoft yet on their side of this, but they are willing, from what I understand, speaking to people on that side of the argument here, they are willing to fight this all the way through. Now, the deal originally wasn't supposed to be closed until June of next year, Eamon, but this could delay it even more.